YouTube friends and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Deidre from Our Upcycled Life. I do lots of thrifting, upcycling, repurposing and DIY content. And today we're working on a craft room organizer that you can put over your door and store all kinds of supplies in it. This is a really easy DIY. You can pick up all the stuff at the Dollar Tree, Dollarama, any kind of dollar store and make one of these. And it works fantastic. So I'm gonna show you today how I'm gonna make mine. To do this project, you're gonna to need to pick up a cooling rack and a over the door basket hanger. You can also use a shower caddy if you can't find one of these. I picked up these little hangers and some multi-purpose ties. And I picked up these baskets. They are almost the same width as the cooling rack. That's the length that you want to look for. And it was a pack of two. The cooling rack was $4 at Dollarama. And I'm sure you can find almost the exact same products at Dollar Tree, Dollar Store, any of them, and pick them up. Now, you, you want to get the cooling rack that has the little legs on the bottom. And we're going to take the over-the-door basket. It was also $4 at Dollarama. And we are going to use the multi-purpose ties to attach them together. I picked up the 50-pack, and they're 6 inches long. These work perfect for this project. If your craft room is like mine, we never have enough room for storage. And I love putting this together. I've got a few that I've made and it just holds so much stuff. And what I like about it is when you place everything in it, you can see what you have and it makes it really easy to organize. You wanna make sure when you're putting this together that the legs on the cooling rack are facing to the back. So when it sits on the back of the door, the legs will keep it propped off away from the door and you're just gonna slide those ties in and attach that basket to the cooling rack. It can be a little bit tricky getting your fingers in there, but just take your time and make sure when you're putting the ties together that you have them even on both sides. So count off the grids in the cooling rack and the basket hanger to make sure that you've got it all even and level so it's not crooked when you have it put together. I've got all the ties secured. I'm just gonna cut off the long ends with the scissors or you can use a pair of side cutters. And you wanna make sure you have enough that it's going to be really securely attached to the back of that cooling grill. And I have these over the door hooks, but these are gonna work great for this project too because we can loop them on the top of that hanging basket to hang any craft supplies that we would like to them also. And it'll slide right in between those wires. Okay, my craft room organizer is coming together nicely. I put in some ties at the back and I made sure I used quite a few of them because it's gonna hold a lot of weight and we want it to be sturdy. I also want it to look pretty and I want it all to be the same color. So I'm gonna take it out to my shed and give it a coat of spray paint. And I'm gonna spray paint these hooks too before we put the rest of it together. Now we're ready to attach these baskets. I didn't spray paint the baskets because they're already black and they also had white ones too. So if you wanted to do the hanger in white and then you could buy the white baskets, that would look really nice also. Now when attaching these baskets, I want to attach it where the legs are because it's more sturdy there. And these baskets, if you're putting anything heavy in, you want to make sure that it's got a sturdy wire across the back. Same as before, I'm going to use those ties and attach it really well. I've got everything all put together and it cost me $12.75 for all this storage in my craft room. I love it because you can see everything. It's right out front and you can grab it as you need it. And that's how easy you can create more storage for your craft supplies in your craft room. 
Buying organizing bins can be really expensive and this is a really great way to create more storage affordably. So head to your Dollar Tree or your Dollarama dollar store and pick up some of these supplies and make one of these organization stations for yourself. If you like this kind of content and you want to help support my channel, make sure to like and leave me a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and we'll see you in the next video. And if you love this video, I'm sure you'll really love the next one. Take care.